Hey my friends, welcome to this week's blog. This week I'm talking about a scale that's very special to me. Uh, it's one of my earliest scales, aside from the B Celtic and the A Russ. This is the B Anolio. Um, I was lucky to procure this many years ago uh, from a friend of mine at that time. And it's one of the most spicy scales that Rav has to offer. Aside from the Arabian Nights, it has the most half steps of any scales as well. Um, so it's one that you have to play with a little bit more attention to where you're navigating on the scale. So let's take a look at what it sounds like and I'll give you a sound example. And then we can talk a little bit more about how this can be applied to other instruments and other situations. Let's take a look. Here are the notes for the B Anolio. So this scale has a lot of half steps. A lot of the ravs are pretty melodic scales. This one has a bit of dissonance. This is an older version of the Anolio. This is from 2017. Um, the newer ones have obviously the golden rim and the new steel and also the turned tongues. So there's not as much crosstalk between the notes. Um, however, even with that on the older model, it sounds beautiful. It's a very unique scale. Um, but you have to be mindful when you're playing it because you have... You have a lot of half steps within this scale, so it's always good to be mindful of the movement of this. Also, the progression of chords is very different on this scale than other scales. Um, instead of just being this going up side by side, this has an almost like an alternating pattern to it. So it's... And all that's doing is changing the half step down on the bottom so that you're not causing dissonance between the bottom five notes. Here's a sound example for you.
All right, my friends, so what did you think? I know this isn't the most popular RAV scale, um, probably because it's one of the more difficult ones. I would rate this one and the Arabian Nights as probably the most difficult of all of them uh, in terms of making up songs that sound very distinct from each other. This has a very particular feel to it, um, and it's great in situations where you want that melancholy Middle Eastern sort of feel. Between the Arabian Nights and this scale, I would say that the Anolio is a little bit more accessible for beginners, um, but it's definitely a very spicy scale, as I said, and has a lot to offer. Um, and you can play it in sort of a major way by avoiding certain notes, but really unique scale, one of the most unique ones that Rav offers, and I highly recommend trying it out if you get a chance. Check out the Bianolio and many more scales on Rav's website, and my question for you this week is what is your favorite place to play? Is it outside or in your house? Um, my preference obviously is outside. But hope you guys are well. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will talk to you next week. Stay well.